Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. My name's Elizabeth Davis, if you're new. I make lots of fashion videos and lifestyle vlogs, so if that's your vibe, then definitely subscribe. So, I have my full clothing rack today of coats that I'm gonna be showing you. Most of these are my fur coat collection. I have lots of faux fur pieces and people are constantly like telling me how much they like my fur coats. So I thought it would be fun to do an updated version of this. And if you like that kind of content, give this video a big, huge thumbs up. Let's get into it. Okay, so the first one I have is from Pretty Little Thing. This is a long fur coat, black, and it has a tie, which always comes off. So normally I wear the coat without the tie because it just falls right out, but it's really beautiful and it's very warm and thick and it is lined on the inside, but you know, like Pretty Little Thing is an affordable fashion website. So this isn't like super high quality or anything like that, but I really like it because it keeps me nice and warm and it's just so easy to style. Like I could literally wear this with absolutely anything. And as you could see, like I'm just wearing like basic jeans and a long sleeve shirt. So really anything goes with this coat. Like that's why I like it. This is a very basic everyday outfit that you could wear. And it's just, I don't know. This coat kind of always makes me feel like Corella Deville a little bit. I don't know why. I think it's the length and the style that just <laughs> just gives me Corella Deville vibes. But next I actually have another black one. This one's a shorter version though. So as you can see, it's not as long. I love the lining, the leopard print. That's so cute. I thought that was such a fun touch. Um, this one is the brand Spoiled Girl. And this was actually given to me. It's second hand. So the person that had it before had a bunch of clothes that she gave away to me, which was so nice of her. And I love this coat. This one's even warmer than the long one, which is super crazy because you think that a longer one would be warmer. But I actually, like it could be the coldest day. Like when I woke up this morning, it was five degrees. I live in Ohio. So we get like really cold January months. And if I wore this outside, like my bottom half would still be freezing, but the top half I'd probably be sweating by the time it was re I was ready to go inside and take it off. So I love this coat. I think it fits so well. It does have a button, so a couple of buttons. And I really like that so I can button up. A lot of times I'll pair a scarf with this or like a hat or something. So that's really nice. And again, just very easy to style. And it does kind of cover my bum a little bit. So if I want to wear like leggings or something and want to be a little bit more conservative, this is a great way to style leggings. The fur on this one is a little bit thicker. Like that one was a little more soft and almost like longer. This one's a shorter fur. Next, I have a really fun one. <laughs> this is from Forever 21. This one's a couple of years old. Um, or a few years now. I can't even remember what year I got it. Like 20, 2019, I would say, 2018. So it's a little bit um, worn as far as I've gotten a lot of wear out of it. And it's just so cute. And I remember this one day I went to the doctor in it and my doctor is like, oh my God, you look like the cookie monster with that coat. So this one's my cookie monster coat. And I can't really think of anything specific. Um, but I have like a lot of pictures in this coat, but I can't remember any like specific memories with it other than showing it to my doctor and her saying that. Like, I just thought that was so funny. My doctor is so cool, I love her so much. But anyway, so it's a size, I think this is a size medium or large, I'm not sure. I have gained a little bit of weight since I bought it, so it's not as loose on me as it used to be, but I feel like I still have a lot of room to move. And fun fact, Forever 21, their coats are pretty much the only thing that suits my body anymore. Like everything else, I feel like their sizing has, I know I've put on some weight, but like, for goodness sake, like, can you guys make some stuff for somebody who's a size 10? Like, or we all have to be, you know, super small to shop there. But anyway, their coats still fit me really well. So that I am so thankful for because I think some of my best coats are from Forever 21. And every time I go in there in the winter time, I always see coats that I, I like fall in love with. So this one was no different. Next is another coat from Forever 21. This one is more like holiday. So Christmas, Valentine's Day. I think I styled this once on 
uh, whatever month it is for the heart awareness for the American Heart Association. I've had this coat for about five years and I try to wear it every single Christmas season because I just love it. And now we're coming up on Valentine's Day, so probably gonna try this on again and wear it out somehow, some way, because this is probably my second favorite in my coat collection that I have. And it's just a gorgeous, gorgeous color. I mean, look at just the way the light picks up on this color of jacket. I think it's so pretty. And the fur on this one is kind of like the shorter black one that I have. The style is pretty similar too. And this one has a snap button instead of like through the hole, but this one didn't have a button at all. So this is nice. Cause again, I can button up if I need to. I don't usually button my coats because I think they're annoying, but <laughs> so this is like probably in my top three for my favorite coats that I have. And I usually style this with like all black. I don't normally like do anything fancy, just a black top and black pants and black shoes. And that's just normally how I, like I want the attention to be on the coat. Do you know what I mean? So I don't wanna be dressing it up with all these fancy things and then the other fancy things take away from this coat. So this is super cute and fun and I just love it. It's just so pretty. So here's the back, kind of comes down over my bum again. So normally I'll wear this with black leggings instead of like dress pants or something. This is hands down my favorite coat that I own. Probably my favorite piece in my entire closet, including shoes and accessories. This coat has been just such a prized possession to me. Not only is it super cute, it's my favorite color. Pink is my favorite color and it's a teddy coat. So it's a different style than my other ones. And this one's from Nasty Gal to size large. I remember I kind of had the same reaction to this coat as I did the red one. And this one was a little more expensive. I think I probably spent like a hundred dollars on this one. And this one's not very heavy. And the quality I will say is not as good as the Forever 21's coats, but here it is. It's pretty long. Um, this hits me. So here's my knees like right here. So it hits probably four inches below the knee. So it's like mid calf length basically. And yeah, this coat is just, it's everything to me. I love it. <laughs> In case you can't tell, I love this coat. And yeah, I always want to tell people it's from Pretty Little Thing, but it's actually from Nasty Gal. And I really wish I could link these coats. Maybe I can find some similar ones online because you know, fur coats are still pretty in style. So um, I think they always will be, but like, I feel like they're just like a big trend for the last few years. So I'll try to see if I can link it. So. Here is, actually, I said the red coat was my first one. This one was actually my first one, this one here. This is like a shaggier one. I'm pretty sure this is like a size small or medium. I can't even remember because there's no tag on it, but I've had this for, oh my gosh, I still danced when I bought this. I think I was probably 20 or 21. So actually my mom bought this for me and I remember I didn't like it when she showed me the picture online. I was like, oh, you know, I could take it or leave it. Like I wasn't in love with it or anything. And then when it came, I was like, ooh, it's so cute. I'm so glad that I didn't refuse it. So my mom found it and then she's like, you need to get it. You're gonna love it when you get it. And I'm like, okay. So I let her, I let her talk me into it and he, lo and behold, I still have it. Four or five, six years later, however many years it's been now. And it's just, it's so fun. Like it's just an easy, pretty coat and it still looks good. And I still have plenty of room to, you know, move around and, um, but this one's short, but the fur is long and I just really like it. It's just still fun, cute, easy to style, easy to wear. This is the OG coat and I'm pretty sure this is from Boohoo. So my mom got this from Boohoo. This was like my first Boohoo purchase as well. So this coat really started a new era of fashion for me. So this one is actually my newest edition. I really like this one. This one is a truly, I cannot believe I found this coat. I was vintage shopping with my mom. We were looking at like vintage home decor and antiques and stuff like that. And it was like this big warehouse. And then one of the booths there had like more fashion related stuff. So obviously I was like looking and looking through it. And I just happened to see this. And I was like, it was kind of like in the back on a clothing rack, like kind of hidden. And I was like, that is uh, a gem. 
And so I was like, let me just try it on and see. Because it looked like it would fit. There's no size. There's no brand. Um, it's pretty, I feel like it's pretty old. Like, it doesn't look new on, like, as far as the inside. The outside looks great. Like, it's in great condition. It's so warm. And I've posted this on my Instagram a couple of times. And, uh, yeah, I just really like it. This one's kind of like a little bit longer than some of the other ones, but not super long. You know, it doesn't come down to the ground or anything, but I love this color. It's a very light pink and it's just, uh, I don't know, I just really love it. It's so cute. <sighs> so this one was actually only like, I think it was originally like $15 or $20 and the girl that sold it um, knocked a few, a few bucks off for me. So I got an incredible deal on it. And then she said, we'll stop back in soon because I always have new ones. And I'm like, well, when I'm ready to add to my fur coat collection again, I know where to go. So she was very nice. That was super nice of her. She didn't have to knock the money off. I didn't even ask her. She just was like, well, I'll give it to you for this. And I'm like, oh, okay. You know, makes me more likely to go back for sure. So she's definitely smart in, uh, in her sale to me with it. But wow, okay. I hope you guys like Hot Mess Express videos. <laughs> This is the next one. This one is an older one. Um, I got this around Christmas time a couple years ago. And it's like a bomber jacket. And it's more of like the teddy style fur. It's short. And I like this one. This is unique. This is uh, different than the other ones, you know. With the, you know, kind of like moto style that it has. And I never really uh, belt it unless it's like freezing and I need to walk like in the wind. For a, di a good distance but if it's really well it's a really great basic and it's like it would be a statement piece in like a neutral outfit kind of like what I'm wearing it's very casual and I can wear it anywhere with anything I could dress it up or down I really like this it's from Forever 21 I don't know if I said that and it's a size large so this one fits me really well <laughs> like it feels the most comfortable of all the other ones that I have um, except for the the black long one the first one so this is cute i really like styling it with this purse i feel like every time i've worn one i wear the other <laughs> this purse is from tj maxx or marshall's i've seen it both places and i got it for christmas so yeah okay guys let's go shopping i really like this coat it's just fun and i've had it for a while and i probably will always have it because you know it's easy to style and it's really cute Thank you guys for watching. Thank you for coming by and hearing stories about all of my favorite coats with me. <laughs> I really like sharing, like, I don't know, sometimes clothes hold like a sentimental value to me. Like they're not just things that are pretty. Like a lot of my clothes, especially ones I've had for multiple seasons, have a sentimental value to me to some level. So thank you guys for watching and listening. I will try to find some coats that like my most favorite ones, like my pink one and red one. I'll see if I can find some other coats. If not, um, definitely still follow me on Instagram, TikTok. I link all of that stuff as, below as well. Thank you guys for watching, and I hope you guys have a great week, and I will see you all in my next video. Adios.